Debate Amar here on Dumb Pal TV, bringing you news that you can use. The countdown is on for the 8th annual Dunn Powell Community Fair. This fair is one of the largest events hosted by the Dunn Powell, bringing in an estimated 3,000 parishioners. The event will begin on April 15th and will run until April 24th and, and will be held in the Haunted Crossing Shopping Center, 2330 West Cumberland Street, Dunn, North Carolina. The proceeds from this event will go towards after school programs at Dunn Powell. For more info, check out the website www.dunpal.org. A night out with the Dunn Police Athletic League will be held on April 26th at the Dunn Pizza Inn from 5 p.m. until 9 p.m. The Powell will receive 10% of your purchase if you present a fundraising flyer. There will be flyers on site that night and you can also pick up a flyer at the Dunn Powell main office. On April 30th at Andy's and Dunn, the Powell will sponsor a pancake breakfast fundraiser. Tickets for this event will be sold and can be purchased from a PAL board member, PAL youth, or at the PAL office. The event will be from 7 a.m. until 10 a.m. Proceeds will benefit the after school program and college scholarships at Dunn PAL. In education news, the PAL is currently accepting applications for the 2011 scholarship program. This scholarship is to benefit high school seniors continuing to higher education. Applications can be picked up in the main offers or found on the Dunn Powell website. The deadline for applications is Monday, May 2nd. The 21st Century After School Program will be hosting the 2011 Easter Program on April 28th at 6 p.m. The program will feature all of the 21st Century classes performing skits, song, and dance. It will also feature the second performance of the Powell Kid Choir. All parents and others are asked to please attend. The Dunn Powell Mentoring Program is seeking more mentors for a sister to sister program and boys to men program. The mentoring program is a great source of inspiration for our youth. For more information or to sign up, contact Francis Williams in the Dunn Powell main office. The Mass Communications Department is still open for students for Powell TV, KMX Radio, and the new Community Youth Choir, which will start on April 11 at 6 p.m. If you are interested in any of these programs, contact Antoine McNeil or Benny McDuffie at the Dunn Powell. The Dunn Police Athletic League presents the 8th Annual PAL Community Fair, April 15th through the 24th at the Haunted Crossing Shopping Center, located at 2330 West Cumberland Street in Dunn, North Carolina. There will be rides, games, food, and plenty of fun. Admission is free. Proceeds are to benefit after school programs at the Dunn Police Athletic League. For ticket prices, armband prices, and hours of operation, please visit dunpal.org. Someone that is making a large impact here at the Dunn Pal. This month we are pleased to feature Ms. Sitara McLean, our youth specialist. So Sitara, how long have you been working at the Dunn Pal and what is your current position? Well, I've been working at Pal for two and a half years and I'm the youth specialist. Okay. How did you come about working at the Pal? Well, being a former Pal kid, I witnessed firsthand some of the things happening here at Pal. So after my college graduation, I realized how hard it was to find a job in my field of psychology. I figured, what better way to serve the community than to come back to my hometown and seek employment here at Dunn Okay. What is the biggest thing that you want kids to take away from here at the Powell in their experience? Well, the biggest thing I want kids to take away from here is that they do not have to be a negative statistic. Nowadays, many people feel like they will never be successful in life, or they'll never do anything big because of where they grew up or where they live now. I encourage kids and people in general to always be the best you that you can be. We should never try to live up to what someone else did, um, try to be big or bad like this person or that person because technically they never walked in our shoes. So they really don't know exactly what we've been through. And I feel like it's always best to do our best at everything we do. We want to thank Mr. Tara McLean for being here today and thank you all for watching. 
This has been Done Pal TV, giving you news that you can use.